Welcome collectors to another edition of Like a Hawk Cards. This is kind of special. This is, I'm helping, helped out a friend, Joe, with his first PSA submission. Um, he wanted to do the, get the bulk rate and I still had my subscription up for another month. So I decided to help him out, prep the cards, send them out to PSA. And now they're back here and he wants to see the grades. He's gonna reveal them on the channel so he doesn't know what they are. So we're gonna do that here. If you're interested in any of these cards, these are available, so you can always put that in the comments below. Um, and yeah, and then at the end of this, I'm also going to be doing a drawing just for Tito 2022. I forgot to put him in the grand prize drawing, so I'm going to do a drawing for him. And then hopefully we can send a prize out his way as well. So let's get into the PSA submission. Um, this is going to be some football, baseball, UFC, and one wrestling card, I believe. Um, and I always found that people, the first time they, they do a submission, they have a lot of luck. Um, I didn't see too many things wrong with these cards, so I'm hoping that they're going to be in pretty good grades. And uh, yeah, so let's just get into it. Uh, PSA again with these came back pretty well. We had, we're pretty fast too, I want to say maybe a month and a month and a half for these at the bulk rate. So um, I think we did pretty well overall. So. Let's, um, let's go ahead and do these first. Pull these out one by one here, or at least a, a little bit. Start this off. All right, so we are going to start off with a football. So we got right off the bat, nice. We have a Gem Mint 10, Justin Herbert, 2020 Mosaic Camel Pink. It's a nice looking card right there especially if you're a Herbert fan. Hopefully they'll get a coach that can unlock the team and actually call some good plays. But looked very clean to me and glad that that one got the Gem Mint 10. So congratulations on that one. Next up, we have another Gem Mint 10. So this is a on-card auto of Jordan Alvarez. It is a rookie card. This is the 2020 Gypsy Queen. And the base auto, there's the back of that. So again, two for two for Gem Mints. Always a nice thing. Here is our wrestling card. So this is a Ultimate Warrior Gold Flash Prism. We got a Mint 9 on this, 2022 Select. There's the back of that. It is number two out of 10. Nice looking, the flash looks really good in the Select, and especially with the gold coming out for, for Warrior. That looked really nice. Next up, we have another Jordan. This is 2021, so his second year. This is again on card. This is a gold refractor. It's gonna be 40 out of 50. Nice looking card, it's a mint nine. Take a mint. There you go. Next up, perfect for this weekend, we have a uh, 2020 Chronicles, Joe Burrow Prism Black Silver. So this is not the base, but the silver version of this. These were the, the ones you could get in the Chronicles packages. There you go. Black cards look kind of cool, especially um, it was nice that you are able to get those within the, um, the Chronicles. So that's a nice card, especially if Burrow goes to the Super Bowl again. Uh, that's a nice one. This one is pretty cool. This is a... Just the paper, 2017 Bowman Ronald Acuna, but there is a Gem Mint 10 on it. So first Bowman of Ronald Acuna. We'll see if he comes back strong this year. Nice to get that. If you're going to grade paper, you're going to want to get it a Gem Mint 10. So congratulations, Joe, on that one. Another little stack here. How about some basketball? I forgot about this. We have a 2019 Clearly Don Ross John Morant. You can see my fingers through that. Very cool to get that. Looks great in a, uh, these Clearly Donruss look great in slabs. That's from the Clearly Donruss set. We'll see if Morant goes to the finals this year. Very Grizzlies look very strong so far. So that's a really cool one. We have another Gem Mint 10, nice. We have a Gem Mint 10 2021 Finest Luis Robert. Robert, I was gonna say, shout out to Jason Aaron Goldberg. Luis Robert. Finest autograph gold, uh, 46 out of 50 on-card auto. 
We'll see if Luis Robert can come back strong. If, if the Sox do fairly well, I'm especially pulling for Eloy. That's a gem mint 10, so that's cool. Okay, this is probably going to be the biggest card of the submission uh, and a perfect timing for what happened this year. So we have a 2017 Topps Gypsy Queen Aaron Judge Auto Black and White Gem Mint 10. The black and white means it's going to be out of 99. So 18 out of 99. So we have an on card out of 99 Aaron Judge Auto from his rookie year, rookie card logo right there. So this is probably the biggest card. Um, there's some big swings on eBay for what this card is in a Gem Mint 10. Um, but very cool to get this. The black and white looks great with the, with the Yankees uh, pinstripes right there. So uh, hopefully that will go to a good home. We have a Jordan Alvarez Finest Autograph Gold. It's like, so this is the same. I believe it's the same card that we just saw. This is 22 out of 50. We've got a Mint 9 on this one. And there's the back of that. We have some UFC. So this is a Ronda Rousey 2017 Tops UFC Chrome. This is for the UFC Fire. We got a Gem Mint 10 on that. Oh, again, always nice to hit the Gem at 10s. I, I'm not familiar at all with UFC. I don't collect it, so I don't know if this is, I believe this might be the base. Um, but, uh, again, nice to hit a Gem at 10 on the Ronda. We'll see if she goes after the tag titles or uh, what happens with her in terms of what's going to happen in WWE with her. Next up, we have a nice 2021 Immaculate, Bo Bichette. Shout out to the Rania boys. 16 out of 25 on this one. This is Mint 9. Immaculate Signature Gold. So very cool. Looks sharp, and, and it's you know it's in a thicker case because the Immaculate is a, is a thicker card, so that's cool that they do that. Here is another uh, Luis Robert 2021 on card auto. This is green, so this is going to be on 99. This is 80. 8 out of 99, which I believe is his jersey number. So that is kind of cool to have that. 88 out of 99. Mint 9 on the Luis Roberts. So those that are looking for his number. Next we have a 2022 Topps Mickey Mantle Salute to the Mick. So I guess these were insert cards. I'm not too familiar with this one either. This was a Mint 9. Salute to the Mick. There's the back of that. It's kind of an old school feel to it. Kind of the, the backing looks a little weathered too. So nice to get a mint nine out of there. Some more football. So we have a 2021 Contenders Optic Lamar Jackson Orange. That is a mint nine. And that is numbered out of 50. So that's 26 out of 50. It's, you can see that right there at the feet. We'll see if he comes back strong. I guess the Ravens are looking to try to sign him again. Try to get his involvement in with the Rook offensive coordinator. So we'll see what happens with them. Last up from this box here. We have a... We'll set this aside here. So we have a nice Kobe Bryant 1996 collector's choice. That's a mint nine. I believe that's just the paper base. There's a very young Kobe Bryant right there. Next up, some more UFC. We have a Ronda Rousey, 2017 Tops UFC Chrome, UFC Fire. There you go. We have a refractor of Ronda Rousey, and this is a Gem Mint 10, so that's cool. 2017 Tops UFC Chrome refractor of Ronda Rousey. There's the back of that. So nice we're getting some Gem Mint 10s. I want to say this might be even with the Gem Mints. Here's another Gem Mint 10 we got of Conor McGregor, 2017 Tops UFC. The Tier 1 looks really cool in that chrome styling of it. There's a Gem Mint 10 of that one. So congratulations there. And then lastly, we have a couple more here to round it out. I think I want to say it was 21 cards here. We got another Gem Mint 10. This is Conor McGregor fired up from Topps UFC Fire. These cards look great in the chrome. Nice gem mint 10 right there. There's the back of that. And finally, Mandy Rose. So we have a Mandy Rose rookie card. 
That is a Gem Mint 10. Mandy Rose still in the news. She's getting reported on by some New York newspapers. And there's a rookie card there of Mandy Rose in a Gem Mint 10. So that is cool. There's the back of that. So congratulations. I, uh, Joe, I think he did fairly well. I would say that in terms of 9s and 10s, fairly even, maybe 10 or 11 of each. Let me know what your favorite card was. Mine, per, mine for sure was the, the Judge, the uh, rookie card of Judge on card auto out of 99. This, this looks great um, with the Gypsy Queen, uh, with the black and white. So congratulations, Joe, on that. All right, so we're going to do the random for Tito. So we're going to hope that he gets this. So I for, again, I forgot Tito in the grand prize drawing. So what I'm going to do, this is just for Tito. Most of the prizes have been sent out already to everybody else. If Tito lands in the top one or two of the random, then I'm going to send out the appropriate grand prize to Tito. So good luck, Tito. Um, I put everybody's name just like I did with the regular random here. And then Tito, there's your name in week seven, which is when you got the... Uh, you got your uh, entry. So good luck. We're going to do this eight times. And then if you're at the top, we're going to send out that prize. So good luck, Tito. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And good luck, Tito. All right. So there we go. There is eight. We had uh, Silver Coin and Bruno at the top. Tito is at number 13 right there. So Tito, nothing for the grand prize. I wanted to make sure that I did this fairly, that I gave you a shot just like you would with the grand prize. Um, I still feel bad about leaving your name out. So if you ever win a prize, or I know if uh, 25 Perez is, a, is part of the, the family, if he wins something and he wants to, I can put something in his package for you that he can send to you, I'm happy to do that again. I think next year with the prizes, I'm going to be doing a, um, a week ahead and I'm just gonna show everybody these are the people that are then drawing. So that way if I make any mistakes, you can look that at that week before and then, um, yeah, look and then just tell me so I can get it all right for, for the next time. So. Uh, Tito, I'm sorry you didn't win this time, but again, I'm going to send a prize to you next time you win a prize or if uh, 25 Perez hits something and he can send it off to you as well. So I really appreciate you checking out this video. Tell me what you thought about PSA submissions. I personally have more of my PSA submissions that are in that I've been holding off showing. I'm going to be doing those in the weeks leading up to Laugh Season 5, so figure that's going to be in February that I'm going to do a lot of that stuff. But uh, really appreciate you, you stopping by and looking at checking out that stuff. Tell me about your hits in the comments. I always love to hear about those. And of course, there's social media, Instagram, at Like Hot Cards, all one word. Hope you have a lot of luck in your next break. And thanks for watching Like a Hawk.